All right, so, um, hmm, not sure how this is going to work. Am I going to lose the audio from the camera? Or will I pick it up with the MP3 player? I don't know. We'll see. Uh, there is an event that is the standard artisan event. I know virtually nothing about it but I'm just going to jump right in the middle of it. I know that uh, you have a standard deck consisting only of commons and uncommons with a few banned cards. I think I have a deck that will fill the bill. Uh, will it win? I don't know. Let's take a quick look at the deck first, just in case it does win. Uh, we're just calling it New Deck 9. I probably need to not talking to my hand that's not a mic um new deck nine yeah all right so i went the knight route uh some knights a little bit uh a little bit of this a little bit of that uh not having some uncommons and rares in there is I've learned to appreciate some newer cards though that's one of the reasons why we do this event joust i, I think i see a that in the future for some other decks coming up here. Um, yeah, I'm just going to jump in here and see what happens. Uh, this is the deck. Uh, I will go through one time slow. You can read the cards. I don't need to read them to you. We're going to go all the way down here. Any lands? Should I swap out any lands? Uh, swamps and mountains. I got tournament grounds in there. Those are uncommon. Yeah, that's it. Let's just jump in here and see what happens. It's going to cost me 500 gems, which I don't have. And this will be, I can probably make those points up. All right. Yeah, there's only one deck possible. Let's see how it does. All right. Play. All right, play through. Yes, yes. Okay. Is it in poor taste if I eat those cup of noodles that are over there? It might be. I apologize. I filmed a episode of Temple's Apprentice earlier today. So you may recognize the same shirt, but I'm kind of hungry. Well, that's interesting. Um, okay, I'll, I'll keep this. I'm expecting or hoping low-powered decks. I see blue right away. Hmm, that's entirely too hot to eat. Uh, so, what do we got here? Well, let's throw this out onto the table. Death touch. Always good. 1-1. One, one. Uh, is he going to let me have it? No, he's going to opt in response. Uh, am I at least going to get one hit in with it? I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought about doing a mill thing. But, no. Uh, I can do this. This will absolutely kill that if I do the Sure Strike. But Death Touch kills it also. So, why waste that Sure Strike until we need it, right? Alright, does he choose to block or does he take the one point of damage? Me eating is off camera, but I also realize I'm leaning down into the mic as I'm taking a bite, so it's pretty rude. I won't do that again. Gummy koala? Hmm. Ooh, yeah, that's that's no good. Um that first strike is gonna make a difference for me this time. 
Let it pass. Double strike. Oh, he's going to swing in with it. Okay. Well, I don't know what I'm expecting here, so... Now... Hmm. One damage to target creature. One damage to his controller. Um... Sure. Again, I, I don't know what to expect here, so... All bets are off. I will forego my card draw. I will... I'm probably playing this entirely wrong. I should... I should hold back. I just... It's just not in my nature. Very hard. Very hard for me to play conservatively. Do I sneak a bite off camera? Sorry. I lied, I'm really hungry. All right, where do we go with this? Uh, that does not have... That doesn't have first strike or anything else. So let's send this in. Wait. Didn't do anything. All right. Now it's second main phase. It's a good time to play a double striker. Oh, and there we go. All right. Well, they're going to try to do the mill thing. I don't have a... I'm not sure I have a strict... Oh, flyer. Hmm. Okay. I'm starting to see the weaknesses of my deck now. What does that do? Top card in the graveyard. Yeah, he's just gonna go for go for that. Well, interesting. So let's do this. Let's let's go ahead and swing first, I guess. Nothing I do. The scrying isn't going to affect anything. I don't have any extra card draw. I should advance the turn. Yeah, okay, so they're going to block this time. All right. And now I will scry. And, um,. I'll leave it just the way it is. Mana doesn't seem to be a problem for me. So. We'll see what happens. Okay, he will swing in, of course. He wants to get as much damage in as he can. And, uh, he gets to draw a card. Oh, no, that goes into his graveyard so he can pull it back later. All right. Jump start for two cards. All right, so I'll get in for at least four more points of damage. At least four. I can make it. Mm. I can make it. Well, I'm not going to make it anything. I'm going to save those and put those in reserve. He's going to try to get me out of cards. 40 cards. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to go fast enough. You know, I already got the scry out of it, so I don't care. That sure strike is always going to be a nice advantage. Go ahead. Attack. Get that damage in while I can. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Sorry. I 
keep saying sorry yet that I keep doing it. Well, this game is taking a while. I'm almost tempted to hit this button and see what it does. Oh, so he's going to have that. Well, I have a little surprise for you, though you are running counter spells. Uh, so we will see. Yeah. There we go. And go ahead. Swing in with everything. Um, I'll make it look like I don't know what I'm doing and I'll give that this right away. Give him an incentive to block. And uh, there we go. I don't know if I really tricked him that time or not, but We'll get the damage in first and let him take three more points of damage. Now that he's seen that, I want to make sure to hold a card in the back. Gonna hold that swamp. He doesn't know what a swamp. He's now seen an instant being played. Maybe he's gonna be reticent about playing or blocking. We'll see. Nope, he's gonna swing in. I think he thinks that damaging or getting my cards into the graveyard is a, a bad thing. And it, it is, up to a point. But only inflicting one point of damage. Oh, yeah, I probably could have used that. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Turn up crowns. All right, we'll throw that down. Yep, because anything that will add to it. Oh, uh, yeah, well, all right. That's fine. You're still taking two points of damage. Yeah. I can just keep whittling him down. Is this she hates it when people talk on or eat on podcasts or eat during any of these things? Interesting. All right. Um, yeah, all right, let's do it. We'll send him on an adventure. Is he gonna stop me from doing it? Nope. Oh, that, yeah, X damage. Nice. All right, and I'll cast it. Now this is when he plays the uh, counter spell, right? No? All right. So I swing in. See if I can get a point of damage at least. Mm, I'm draw some cards. I think I think I've got this one wrapped up. I don't know though. Let him live in fear of my swamp. That's going to be annoying. All right. Got to get around that life linker. Swinging in. He can block one, two. Yeah, he's holding it back. All right, what's this? Return. Well, let's do that. Unless he has a counter spell, which he may very well have. What is going to do the most? Uh, oh, how about this? Could I potentially kill him with this one? What does that do? I'm gonna pay the two. I'm gonna pay the two to put this on board. Hey, there we go, good game. All right, sir. Good game indeed, unless you are just playing with my, toying with my emotions, but you weren't. All right. So we won our first game. That deserves a bite of noodles. Sorry.
a little bit of my gold back. Forgotten how much gold I already spent on this. It doesn't matter. The gold come easy. The gems, they don't come so easy. Um, sure. I'm feeling cocky after that win. I'll go ahead and start with just two land. Three land would have been better, but we'll see. Hello. Is that your way of telling me to hurry up, or is it just uh, you're being friendly and greeting? We'll see. Interesting. All right. So now, two. I can put a flyer out there. I can put a life linker out there. I can swing in for three. I am going to swing in for three because I actually think those adventures are going to make a difference later on. We'll see, though. Hmm. He held back that mana. What do I not care about? I'm gonna go ahead and wait till my second main phase just to see if he has anything. It's a little too early in the game for them to probably fear anything. As soon as I don't pump it up, they're gonna know something else is coming. They will decide they've made the right decision. I like the idea of this creature having menace, but, okay. I thought for sure that was gonna get, uh, thought that was gonna get countered. Maybe it's not that kind of deck, though. Oh, that. Well, all right. What are we doing here? So we do this. So we're going to get through for three. We can easily... Yeah, all right. So I'm going to go ahead and swing with both. Oh, nice. Nice. If they throw a blocker down, I'm not going to. Um, well, all right, I guess we'll get as many knights on the board as we can, and then we'll hope that our smitten swordmaster finishes the game for us. I have a feeling there's going to be another blocker. It's got some shenanigans coming, I'm sure. I think I want the lifelink. So, gonna play this. And then, you can block and kill it. I don't particularly care, the other things will get through. I maybe should have played the knight instead. Hmm. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and save that so I can scry next turn. Um, I maybe should have played the Order of Midnight. 
but other oh, knights get plus one, plus one. All right, what is this? Rally the wings. Oh yeah, see that's not good. Okay, well this he can't choose to block. This will give me some life regardless. That's double strike. So I can kill whatever he blocks. Best thing is going to be the red cap to stop. All right. Okay, well, it's not the best, but it's not the worst either. He's down to four. He has shown me that he has some shenanigans, though, so I am a little worried. Other flyers, plus one. All right. How can I make this work? Um, so, what can we do? I'm going to bring something back from the graveyard. Which one's it going to be? How about this one? Yeah. Oh, but I'm not going to be able to. Oh, yes, I will. So I'm going to spend these. I can now play this. Hmm. He's going to have to double block there. Ugh, this is going to be tight. Let's see what happens. So. Oh, see, I'm going to lose a knight, though. But as long as I have one at the end of this exchange... Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know what's going to happen. If I was smarter and could do math better, I'd probably have a better idea. But all right, yeah, yeah. And then that goes through, and then I think I got it. Unless he has a counter spell, that would be sad. There we go. Good game. Okay. Oh. Interesting. I'm not sure you want to watch this for 20 minutes, but we're on a winning streak at least. What did I get? Got, oh, I got something else there. Death Touch? I like that. All right. So now what are we playing for? We're playing for the Beanstalk Giant. All right. Well, let's see how he goes. I'm back. Hmm. Uh, ba -da -ba -ba. All right. It's worth trying. So this Joust, it's a new card. New to me. I've been playing Knights, as you know if you've been watching. Um, but this is the first time I've actually used joust in a deck with knights with death touch so we'll see what the first thing he puts out is 2-2 two, two flyer all right what does that mean to me um it means that they will die sorcery Plus two plus one. Um, hum, hum, hum. Yeah, all right. So, I'm going to go ahead and swing first, see if he makes the choice to block. If he doesn't, I could double the sprint and the joust next turn. Maybe I'll put down something else that's a better target. Like that. Yeah. Okay. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go my turn. Put down 
on the red. It's a lot just to, to kill that thing, uh, but I don't want that attacking to make it food tokens, so. <laughs> All right, I think target creature I control, target creature they control, spin. I want to make sure and spend this time because I don't trust to do it for me and I'll put that out and it's like it never even happened hmm. haste what does else does that do haste when you gain life for the first time put it back in your hand oh do I want this you know I'm Obviously, they've got life gainers, otherwise they wouldn't put that in there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and block. All right. What do I have here? So, I put this, this, and this. Put this on there. Got another creature coming. I'm okay with that. And let's get six points of damage on him. That cost one. And I can still get... Oh, well, fine, fine. common, huh? We might have to add that to this deck. Alright, so this comes out. Give it haste and swing in, but he's going to play that hunter again, so I better, better hold off and wait for the hunter. the turn. Take that damage. Right. Any way I can get this thing to survive. One, two, not really. What is that? That's an uncommon. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So. That will definitely kill it. And I might as well save the other one for later, so... Actually... Let me cancel. Let me swing in, see if he takes the damage, and then I can still kill it before the end of turn. Um, attacks or blocks. Nope, he can create a food token, so I better do it now. And I think we're going to lose this one. They're down to only one card. That's something. Interesting. All right. What's coming back from my graveyard? Something good. Uh... I guess I'm going for the Death Knight. Draw a card, Liz. Um, and let's play this. Can't block, though. So, but... Hmm, I get to scry off of this and I get to hit him this turn. Um, I think it's worth it. Can I get a red off to do this? 
No, that's only to cast equipment or... Yeah, I can't do that. So, uh, I can cast the knight though, and I think I need to get this out on the board to block anything that he might throw at me on the ground. Or, if I draw another joust, I got the chance to to kill his creature, whatever it might be. And, son of a... Well, better that, I think, than my flyer. We'll see. I obviously can't block. What does he get? Whenever he casts... Okay, interesting. What is that? That is an uncommon. Alright, what is this? Destroy target artifact. Uh... Now, can't do anything with that. Do this, and I get to scry. Well, let's just unload our hand, see what happens. Not gonna be able to block. Can't do anything about that, so that's an easy two. This is possibly, he's not gonna block, so I might as well go for maximum damage, right? And I can see what's coming up. I like that, but I think it's a little too little too late. Is he going to block it? He'll probably take the damage. Yeah. And hope to draw into something. He's going to hit me for at least three. At least three. And he's going to create a freaking food token, so he's going to gain three life. Well, I'm going to take that life. And he freaking gets the knight back. And that's haste. It is that game. He's coming in for seven. All right. How do I magically get 10 damage out of this? I don't. So, spend the two, spend the one. He can't block anyhow, so I am dead. Last act of defiance, swing with everything. And I'll even give him a good game. And then I'll end it on my terms. All right, so I lost. Am I out of the event? Let's find out. How many losses do you get? Or you just keep playing until the event ends? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I want to break this up into two videos. Nobody wants to watch me play this for 30 minutes. I mean, if you did, thank you. But, uh... Hmm.